Two of the most unhealthy feelings a Christian can have are bitterness and anger. There are many traits that the Word of God warns Christians against. You'll find them all listed out in the book of Galatians. They are sexual immorality, impurity, debauchery, selfish ambitions, and many others. But among them all, there are two which the Bible sternly warns us not to have anything to do with. They are anger and bitterness, also known as fits of rage. Not only does the Bible warn us against them, but it also advises us not to associate with individuals who possess these traits. Proverbs 22:24 says, Don't make friends with a hot-tempered man. Do not associate with one easily angered. This is another confirmation from the scriptures. As Christians, we are the replicants of God, an extension of his personality living on earth. You have been birthed after God's kind, and this requires that you exhibit his character, which are the fruits of the spirit. So, in place of anger, God gives gentleness and self-control. Hear what the Bible has to say about bitterness in Hebrews 12, 15. It says, See to it that no one misses the grace of God and that no bitter roots grow up to cause trouble and defile many. This emotion called bitterness is so destructive that the Bible not only warns against it, but against its roots. This is because bitterness can go unnoticed until it has wrecked havoc. It's true that the Bible does not command that you do not get angry. However, it does caution, saying, in your anger, do not sin. Do not let the sun go down while you are still angry. In your relationship with humans, you should be prepared for offenses, unfair treatment, and being upset. You may be able to keep yourself from hurting people, but you cannot control others from treating you badly. So you must consciously keep your heart in check, free of guilt, bitterness, and strife. A tree of anger and bitterness which is cut down can spring back to life at the slightest provocation that acts as rain if its roots are not destroyed. This is why you must stay away from bitter and hot-tempered people, because evil company corrupts good character. They influence and plant negative seeds in your mind. God is a God of peace, and he admonishes that you follow peace with all men and live holy, without which no man can see the Lord. It is okay to come to God with anger and bitterness as your weaknesses, but it is an error to stay bitter and angered. If you can trace any of these to your life, stay with God in prayer until he heals you and replaces them with his good virtues. Like the video if you believe this message contains something that could change your life. Please don't ignore it.